If you can crochet a rectangle, you can make a hat. Let's go! I like my hats large. I hate it when hats are too tight on my head. So if you're like me, this may be the hat for you. Today we're making an adult sized extra large beanie hat. This hat feels like a dream when you're wearing it. And I think this might be the perfect size hat. It's super easy to make because we're only going to be using one stitch, the half double crochet. So let's get started. You're going to need yarn, I'm using a medium four weight yarn. This is actually Red Heart Super Saver. And the color is Icelandic. You'll need a crochet hook. I'm using a size I or a 5.5 millimeter hook. You'll need scissors and a yarn needle. We'll start by making a loop and inserting the crochet hook in the loop. To create tension and help control the thread, I wrap the yarn around my pinky finger and over my index finger so that the thread looks like this. Then I use my index and middle finger to help create tension on the yarn as I work. Insert the hook under the yarn on your index finger. Hold on to the tail of the loop we made earlier and pull the yarn through. You've made your first chain loop. Do it again, grabbing the yarn on your index finger and pull through. For this hat, we will make 51 chain loops. And this is going to be the length of the hat, not the width. So you can actually add or subtract loops if you want it shorter or taller, like if you want to make a slouchy hat. Once you get to the end of your first row, you'll yarn over, skip two stitches, insert your hook, and pull the yarn through. Yarn over, pull through all three loops, and you've done your first half double crochet. To do it again, we'll yarn over, go to the next loop, insert the hook, and pull the yarn through. Yarn over, and pull through three. We're going to repeat this through every loop down the chain. When you get to the end, we're going to chain two. So we'll yarn over and pull through, yarn over and pull the yarn through. Then we'll turn our work. If you look at the top, you have a very nice long V chain. We're going to only work in the back part of the chain. Then we're going to skip the loop that our chain is coming out of and go to the next loop and work our first double crochet. And we'll continue doing this until we have 52 rows in all. And after some time, eventually you'll have your rectangle. When you get to that point, we're going to fold it in half. Take your hook still attached to the last loop and put it through the next front loop. Not the back like we did through the whole hat, but we're gonna work through the front this time and through the first whole chain of the other half of the hat. Basically, at this point, you should have three loops on your hook. Then pull the yarn through all three. This is called a slip stitch and we're going to use it to close up the seam. Put your needle through the front loop again and through the next chain on the back half and pull the yarn through. Once we get to the end, we're going to make a loop and pull quite a bit of yarn through. I really wanted to make sure I had enough to work with because it's better to have too much than too little. Then I threaded the yarn onto a yarn needle and I wove the needle in and out of the top loops. You don't have to be super accurate here because this is how we're going to pull the yarn tight to make the top of the hat. But you know, you, you kind of want to get through most of the loops. Once 
Once the yarn worked its way through, I pulled the yarn tight and tied a knot. Next, we'll just cut the yarn and work the two yarn pieces through to secure the ends. And that's it! Now we have a comfy, not too tight, extra large adult hat that feels like a dream. Okay, everyone, that's all for now. Let me know what you think in the comments down below, and I'll see you next time.